Caitlin here with Embroidery Library with a new project, this easy breezy beach cover-up. It stitches up fast with light and open summery designs. Here's how it's done. To get started, cut a piece of knit to 40 inches wide by 76 inches high. To adjust the length of the cover-up, adjust the height measurement of the fabric. At 76 inches high, the cover-up will be about 38 inches long when it's completed. To create the top opening, first fold the fabric in half lengthwise, and then again in half widthwise with the folded edge on the right. Measure and mark 4.5 inches in along the top edge of the fabric, starting at the upper right corner. Then, measure and mark 4 inches down along the right edge of the fabric, starting at the upper right corner. Draw a line in between the marks. I am making the line curve in slightly. This will make a scoop-shaped neckline. Pin the fabric in place along the outer edges. Then cut along the line. Cut through all layers of the fabric. Unfold the fabric and lay it flat. Now for the embroidery. Print a template of the design using embroidery software. Position the design where you would like it and mark the center point and the horizontal and vertical axis lines. Turn the fabric over with the wrong side facing up. Spray a piece of cutaway stabilizer with temporary adhesive and smooth the stabilizer on the back side of the fabric. Hoop the fabric and stabilizer together by aligning the marks on the fabric with the marks on the hoop. Attach the hoop to the machine and load the design. Move the hoop so the needle is directly over the center point on the fabric. Embroider the design. When the design has finished, trim away the excess stabilizer on the back side of the embroidery. Next, fold the fabric together lengthwise, right sides together, and align the side edges together. Pin in place. Measure and make marks 15 inches down along each side edge, starting at the top corners. Zigzag stitch along each side, starting at each bottom corner and stopping at the marks. I'm using a ballpoint needle, which works great when sewing with knit fabric. So about one half inch in along the edges of the fabric. Then fold the arm openings in one half inch to the wrong side and pin. Zigzag stitch around the openings. Next, cut a one half inch slit at the bottom of the V at the front neckline. Fold the edges of the top opening in one half inch to the wrong side and pin. Sew a zigzag stitch around the top opening. Turn the edges of the bottom opening in one half inch to the wrong side pin, and sew a zigzag stitch around the opening. Turn the cover up right side out, and it's done! This cover up is a fast and fun addition to your summer wardrobe. Here are some other great ways to add embroidery to summertime fun. Embroider light and colorful designs on cool and comfortable knit garments like t-shirts and dresses. Carry all your poolside, oceanside, or lakefront essentials in this handy beach towel roll-up. Cleverly made with a hand towel and a beach towel, it doubles as a beach blanket and a tote bag. Did you know you could embroider directly onto rubber waffle placemats? Follow these easy instructions to whip up some colorful additions for your next picnic or summer getaway. Thanks for watching today. For more videos, machine embroidery designs, and tutorials, visit our website, www.emblibrary.com.